Hey guys, what is going on and welcome back to another Touchdowns to Home Runs. I'm your host Noah and today we got another helmet concept video for you guys today. We are doing the Big 12 this time around. Last time we did the SEC, now we're doing the Big 12. Just a few things before we get started. One, guys, if you have subscribed, thank you so much. Your support to this channel means a lot to me and my partner Bernie. We're almost at a thousand subs, so we're working hard. We're trying to get there. So if you aren't subbed, please help us get to a thousand subs soon. We're we're trying to put out some of the best sports content on YouTube and we promise we will not let you down so definitely go subscribe and guys if you want to learn how to make some of these helmet designs your own helmet designs or anything sports related definitely go hit up sports templates.net he's got a whole ton of different templates where you can create literally anything sports related you can do some really cool things with these so guys definitely go check him out okay so now let's get started on these designs so there are 10 teams in the big 12 and I made one for each one. This time, rather than the SEC one, I felt like in the SEC one, I made them look too much like helmets they'd actually wear, like wanna wear on the field and they're too bland. This one, I really tried to make these fun concepts, stuff that you guys will like to see rather than just some boring old helmets that sometimes you see on the field i want to make some really fun designs here so i don't actually think that well some of them i could see teams wearing but some of them are just for fun and i wanted it to look like a really cool design so that's why i went with here so going in alphabetical order starting off we have the baylor bears this one i went with an all yellow helmet with the green stripe down the middle and i love that bear logo so i had to put that on there somewhere but again just all yellow especially if they did an all yellow uniform game or even with their green uniform i think that this would look really nice so to have that yellow helmet with that amazing bear logo on the side that's what I really want to go for in doing this one. Coming up next, we have the Iowa, Cy Iowa State Cyclones. Now this one, I got the bird logo on the side. That isn't a logo that you usually see from them. So I really wanted to put that on the side. A white and yellow stripe down the middle, yellow face mask. So it's kind of like the bird's head. And then you got the beak. If you can kind of see as the face mask is yellow, that's what I was kind of going for there. But again, just a logo that I don't see very often from Iowa State. So I wanted to put that on there because I think that is an amazing logo and it shows their mascot off, which I love doing in these helmets. Speaking of showing off mascots, this one coming up next, we have Kansas. This logo, again, isn't one I see very often from Kansas. I don't think I'd ever seen it until I started researching logos for this. Again, this is just for fun. I really want to put that logo on there because I thought it's something new I'd seen. And maybe it's new for you guys. Maybe it's not. But I think it's new. And I just wanted to put it on the helmet, see how it looks. You got, again, you're showing off that mascot. Just how I was talking about in that last one. How I really like showing off the team's mascot or animal or whatever that is. So that's what we're doing here in showing off that Jayhawk you got the blue and yellow stripe down the middle with a blue face mask I like this helmet it's fun I don't think that they'd actually wear something like this on the field but again this is just for fun and this is just to put some together some cool concepts next up we have Kansas State this one I went with a purple chrome helmet with that big wildcat logo on it really showing off that logo and then all the rest of the helmet is purple except for that back pad which is white but again just a chrome helmet to see that from Kansas State and really enlarge that um, Wildcat logo. The one on the helmet currently is small. I love to see it nice and big like that. That would look amazing, I think, on their helmets, especially if they did an all purple game or something like that. That helmet would look amazing on the field. Next up, we have the Oklahoma Sooners. Now this one I went with, as you can see around the OU logo, I made a wagon wheel or whatever, showing off the Sooners. I'm huge into like getting into that like team's history. You got the Sooner Schooner, like one of the traditions of the team. So I wanted to put something that related to that on this helmet. So that's why I went with the wagon wheel. And then you got the OU logo, just a uh, classic white helmet. Uh, what do you call it in Oklahoma? It's either maroon or crimson and the uh, stripe down the middle and then a crimson or maroon, whatever you call it, face mask. Next up, we have the Oklahoma State talking about how I really love tradition and all that stuff. I went with the um, 
the paddles, the Oklahoma State paddles that say go pokes on them. I really want to incorporate that somehow in this helmet. So I had it coming across the side. You got the paddle and then it says pokes on it. I think that that would look amazing. I think that the fans would love this because that is a huge part of their tradition down in Oklahoma State. And really cool. And you got the orange face mask and then the rest is just all black. Um, again, just really paying tribute to their tradition i think that that would be something awesome to put on a helmet for college football next up we have the texas longhorns i really want to go with a burnt orange helmet that's something that they don't use so that's why i went with the burnt orange and then just that texas state outline or the state shape you don't need to have any words or anything on that to know that that is Texas and they are the Texas Longhorns so that why that's why I went with this and you got the Texas state flag on the back there but again just that one state shape shows Texas you know it's Texas so that's why I went with this one next up we have TCU this one I went with a purple chrome helmet with that big frog logo on it you got a white stripe down the middle and then you got the like chrome silver face mask and then the white back pad. This one, I know TCU has a lot of chrome helmets, from, but from the research I did, I don't think they have one like this. So I really want to make another chrome one for them like this with the big frog on it. And I wanted it purple with that stripe down the middle. Just another really cool chrome helmet to add to TCU's collection. Next up, we have Texas Tech. So this one, what I was going for here is I want to use that Texas Tech font in here, but just alone on the helmet, I thought that that was pretty boring. So I want to add something else. So that's why I got the Lone Star. I got the Texas State Star on there. Make it look, uh, pay tribute to Texas or something like that and just give it that extra detail to make the helmet look more exciting and everything. And I think it looks great. You got that red stripe down the middle. The rest of it is black. I'd love this in a blackout uniform game or a Texas Tech did some kind of throwback game i feel like that that helmet would look nice even though they haven't really worn anything like that for a throwback but it looks kind of throwback like i just really like this helmet and i love how uh i really wanted to use that texas tech uh word mark and then add something on top of that now we're coming up on my favorite one so we got west virginia we got a blue helmet navy blue helmet with the face mask and everything and then i added a mountain range like pattern going along the helmet and then i actually put the uh wv west virginia logo to make it look like it is actually a part of the mountain and coming out of the mountain and then uh just to the left of the wv logo you see how it says mountain mama because if you know the song country roads by john denver west virginia is one of my favorite states i drive through it all the time going to south carolina and i absolutely love the mountains and everything in west virginia so i had to do they're called the mountaineers i had to do um this or something related to that and I love that song too. I'm a big country fan too. I love that song. So I want to add that somewhere on it. If you look at West Virginia's current helmets, they I'm pretty sure on the back pad, it says country roads. So I kind of went with the opposite of that and put mountain mama with the mountain range and everything. Again, I don't know if I'd see them wearing this on the field, but it's just a really cool concept to think about. And I love it. I love the concept. So thank you for watching this video, guys. Again, definitely go hit up sportstemplates.net if you want to go um, make some of these for yourself. Like the video, comment which one was your favorite or anything you change about any of them. And thank you for watching and come back next time.